We've got an exciting new update on our analytics feature for creators, brands, social media managers, and agencies. The Planally Analyze feature on our web dashboard has been revamped to provide more powerful data and insight into your Instagram grid and stories content. Planally Analyze eliminates manual engagement calculations, allowing creators or brands to monitor their content's performance seamlessly. Here's how to access Planally Analyze on web. Go to your Planoly web dashboard and click on Analyze on the top right-hand corner to access your analytics. Keep in mind, the analytics you'll see depend on whether you have a free Planoly account or a paid Planoly account. With a free Planoly account, you can only view specific data, while a paid Planoly account unlocks premium analytics, giving you a deeper look inside your Instagram metrics. Remember, it's never too late to upgrade to a paid account, and it pays for itself with the time you save not tracking your own analytics every week. Note, you can only access premium analytics if you have both a paid Planoly account and a business Instagram account. If you recently switched to a business account, the Analyze tab will only begin gathering analytics starting from the time you switched from a personal to business or creator Instagram account. Choose between a specific time frame to view your analytics. On the top left-hand corner, you'll see time frame with a specified month, date, or year view. To update this time frame, go to the top right-hand corner of your dashboard and click into the blank box beside the calendar icon. Here, you'll see a calendar drop-down menu to select your date range between the month, day, and year you'd like to view your content analytics. You can also see your analytics based on a week, month, or year view. Access this by going to the top right-hand corner of your dashboard and clicking into each of those categories to swap out your metrics view. Now, let's dive into free analytics versus paid analytics. If you have a free Planoly account, you can view basic Instagram analytics and insights. This free version includes follower insights within a specified time frame, your post engagement overview, and your content performance totals. On the left-hand corner of your dashboard, you'll see followers data. This data breaks down your total followers between a specific start and end date range, along with the number of followers that you gained or lost. Directly below your followers data is your post engagement overview. This includes data for your images, videos, and other content posted in your selected timeframe. You can also view total posts, likes per post, and comments per post here. You'll then be taken to your story engagement overview, which includes story data in the selected time frame for your total stories, your replies per story, and your taps per story. Below this, you'll find the meat of your metrics, your content performance totals. These are the total numbers for all metrics for your Instagram grid and story content. Here, you can compare metrics from the previous week, month, or year, and the current week, month, or year and view likes and comments only. Things get real with our premium analytics. With the paid Planoly account and a business or creator Instagram account, you'll be able to view all of the data we've mentioned above while also unlocking our premium analytics. These metrics play a key role in strategizing and building your content marketing strategy. These advanced metrics are exactly what you need to level up. Along with being able to view followers data, post engagement overview, story engagement, and certain content performance totals, you receive stats for other content performance total, including impressions, reach, saves, viewed videos, and replies to stories. Want to know what your audience is like? Go to the middle of your dashboard view to access audience insights. Here you can view location, gender, age, and activity for your audience. Click on location to view where your followers are located based on cities and countries. Click on gender to view the percentage of your audience based on female, male, and unknown. Click on age to view the age range and percentage of your followers based on all men or women. And click on activity to view the average times that your followers are most active on Instagram. In this section, directly beside your audience insights, you can view engagement based on post, story, profile, and averages. This gives you a larger view of how your content is performing across the board. Let's start by seeing how your posts are performing. Click on Post to access metrics based on photos, videos, and carousel posts that have been posted to your Instagram grid. Click on each content tab, photos, videos, or carousel posts 
to get a better understanding of each content you're creating or posting and how it was received by your audience. Here, you'll see your engagement rate, impressions, reach, likes, comments, saved, and viewed, if video, for each of your content. Click on Story to access metrics for your Instagram stories. Here you can view engagement rate, impressions, reach, replies, taps forward, and taps back for each story. You can check in on your profile's performance too. Simply click on Profile to view profile visits, get direction taps, website taps, call taps, text message taps, and email taps. Then click on Averages to view your total averages on your posts and stories based on engagement rate, impressions, reach, likes, comments, saved, replies per story, and taps per story. And we can't forget about content performance. Directly below your audience and engagement insight lies your content data. Here you can navigate between grid and stories to see how your content is performing. Start by clicking on grid. Here you can individually select photo, video, or carousel content to view metrics for that specified date range. By clicking onto each specific content, you'll be able to see an in-depth look at your analytics for that post. To the right, you'll see that you can also sort by these top post metrics. View Stories Analytics by clicking on Stories. Here you can view metrics on stories within your chosen date range and sort by these top stories metrics. Please note, in order to have access to view your stories analytics, you must first enable tracking by clicking on the Enable Tracking button below the Stories tab on web. Once you click on this button, you will then be able to view your stories analytics starting from the day it is enabled and moving forward. So, how pumped are you feeling about the new Planoly Analyze? We hope our new and improved Analyze update is a perfect way for you to take your social media marketing strategy to the next level. And as always, if you have any questions, feel free to drop into our DMs where we'll respond to you right away.